So I was researching some other planes to design and I found the Sonic Subsonics JSX-2 which is a really cool personal jet that you can buy yourself and then build and then fly in and it was really cool so I decided to design one and I'm gonna I'm gonna try it might be a little hard but I'm gonna try to do it so let's see
one easier one and then one harder one because the first one started out really looking really good it's this one I cut a little hatch in it but I decided I didn't want it to be like that but it looked really good so I didn't want to just stop at one version so I improved that one made it have a little removable nose so if you pull this out you can take the front off and there's like a little place you can put stuff and there's a little barky skewer to keep it on on the top and that works really well and then I didn't want to I actually this is the last one I designed actually so after that one I wanted to make a round version so I tried doing it with foam because I wanted it to be stronger and I made this and I didn't really love that look it kind of broke after a little while so I didn't love that look so, and I wanted this part to be removable, so I made this. And this one's laser cut, because my school has a laser cutter and my teacher's awesome and then lets me use it. But this one looks a lot better, it just has a few things I needed to adjust, like covering up this little crack, I don't think you can see that. There's like a little crack right here, and right here. And so all I needed to, it comes off, so all I needed to do was fix those two things that make this poster board piece longer and then come out with this the final version of the harder one and it's really not that hard to build it just takes a little while it's patience because it might not work the first time so you might have to make two hatches but it comes off there's an can't get the lighting any better. There's a little tray in here. There we go, yeah, I can see it. There's a little tray in here to put stuff and the hatch just slides on and on, on and off, and you can just put it back in by putting a barbecue skewer through this little piece down here. And then it stays on. So yeah, this project worked really well. And this is probably my favorite design out of the two that I did. So, if you haven't already, subscribe and comment if you want to. And I'll see you next time.